How can we draw closer to God today? My name is Hosanna Wong. I'm the author of You Are More Than You've Been Told. And today's verse is something I have not always gotten right. Jesus is talking to his disciples, his apprentices. And in John 14, 21, he says this, whoever has my commands and keeps them is the one who loves me. The one who loves me will be loved by my father and I too will love them and show myself to them. Jesus knew that some people would say they love God would not want to obey God, that some people would say that they follow Jesus, but wouldn't actually want to follow the way Jesus said to live. Jesus was saying, we show Jesus we love him when we obey him, not when we just quote what he says, but when we live what he says. I think about the times I needed to forgive someone, but I didn't feel like it. Or the times I needed to confess something, but I didn't feel like it. I think about when almost 13 years ago, when I felt God called me to live on the road and share the gospel, and I ended up living without a home um, in guest rooms and cots and living rooms for four and a half years. I remember when he called me, I didn't feel like it. But everything God calls us to do and everything he commands us to is not just about what he wants from us. It's about what he wants for us. He has something more for us that we can't see on this side of our yes. I know for me that by obeying God, forgiving, confessing, and taking a step of faith and trusting him, I was set free from fears that used to hold me back, healed from wounds that I used to keep hidden, and I drew closer to God than I ever knew was possible. I have never regretted obeying Jesus. Today, what is one way you can love God? Through your obedience. Obeying God brings you into a closer, more real, and more intimate relationship with him.